In this tutorial, I am using 19 pictures, one snapshot and one video, so drag down the video and take a snapshot at the start of the video. Delete the video on the timeline, drag down any image, crop to fit if necessary, scale down to 20 and drag top left as shown on the screen. Drag down another picture, copy and paste the effect from first picture and drag down as shown on the screen. Again drag down another picture, copy and paste effect and drag down as shown on the screen, and continue the process until it's 5 pictures. Next, adjust the timeline to normal for visibility, move playhead forward and drag another 5 pictures. The second track is meant for the snapshot I took earlier. Move playhead forward and drag down another 5 pictures. Now, copy and paste effect from the first set of pictures to the other pictures horizontally. Good, now take a snapshot of the three pictures in column and delete afterward. Next, drag down the first snapshot and scale up to 168, and drag left as shown on the screen but make sure three grid pictures fit the screen. Animate upward to fit the screen. Drag down another snapshot, scale up to 168 and drag to the middle from the bottom. Animate downward until it fits. Drag down the third snapshot, scale up to 168 and drag to the right from the top on the screen. Animate upward until it fits. Now export. Delete all on the timeline, and import the exported file and drag it on the timeline.
Take two snapshots at both ends. Move back the clip on the timeline, drag down the first snapshot and reduce to 1 second. Move the clip closer and apply freeze frame and reduce the freeze frame duration to 18 seconds. Click on the snapshot and apply pan and zoom for smooth movement at the start. Click the imported clip and apply freeze frame at the end and reduce duration to 18. Now drag down the second snapshot took at the end and reduce to 1 second, and apply pan and zoom. I noticed the zoom out overlap, so I had to adjust the pan and zoom again. Now I will drag down the video I took the snapshot at the beginning of this tutorial, reduce the duration and apply flash transition with 10 seconds duration. Done, but to give it a different look I applied enlarge effect. I also apply lens correction downloaded under new blue FX with big bird presets, please make sure you subscribe.